heat is intense outside, but much more so for working firefighters. As Ivy Woodard reports, one local group comes to their rescue. While firefighters douse the hot spots, the Signal 51 Club is keeping them cool. Where's the fire? Well, wherever the fire is, that's where these guys are. They're not firefighters, but they've become vital to the Shreveport Fire Department. They're the Signal 51 Club, a volunteer group that assists firefighters with juice, Gatorade, coffee, or whatever is needed to keep these guys going while on the scene of a fire. If they're brave enough and strong enough to go into these fires, um, in this temperature with all that equipment on, the least we can do is get out there and provide some refreshments for them. These firefighters look as though they could certainly use a cold drink after fighting this four-alarm fire in Shreve Square back in July of 1990. As firefighters put it, they're fortunate to have a group like Signal 51. It's a fire we had on Prospect where we had uh, two children trapped inside and we had one fatality. Um, it was a very, very hot day and it was a very, very hot fire and uh, the Signal 51 group was there way before the fire was out and they furnished the uh, uh, Gatorade and uh, uh, assisted. They're, they're just a super bunch of people. We come out of a fire, we're hot, thirsty, or if we're cold and, and uh, a little hungry, they're there. It doesn't matter if it's four in the afternoon or four in the morning, they're going to be there with coffee or sandwiches or Gatorade or whatever we need. Members of Signal 51 say they like what they do. It's exciting. I mean, uh, you can be in the bed at two o'clock in the morning, you can get a phone call, and all of a sudden in about five to ten minutes, you're mobilized to where you're in the car and you're actually going to a fire. The group says it would like to preserve old fire engines and other fire equipment to start a museum. We have uh, plans to uh, set up a fire museum um, down on the riverfront, have it sort of a hands-on operation where kids can go in and play uh, on some of the old rigs. They say they do what they do because they think firemen are special. Firemen are special people. You know, those are the talk about the heroes of wars and stuff, but you know, wars only last, you know, at the most, what, five years in the last war or, or you know, just a few months for Desert Storm. But these firemen, they're heroes, and they, they go to war against fire for 20, 30 years sometimes, fight it all, every day, just about every day they work. So they're the real unsung heroes of the city. Ivy Woodard, Channel 3 News.